all of us were trying to uh, plan out our weeks. We got all of our work sorted out uh, a few days in advance and uh, left about eight o'clock last night, um, flew into Philly. Everything was smooth. Um, uh, just got our stuff, went straight to the hotel. Um, and then since then, we've just been planning and getting ready to, uh, to play tomorrow. So I think everyone's really excited. Uh, this is definitely a big stage. We're definitely ready for it and uh, we're excited for this game. Um, yeah, this is definitely a great venue. Um, everyone's looking forward to playing here. Uh, when you when you get to this this stage, um, it, it's just great to, to play on a nice field, and uh, and it's it's a great opportunity for us to uh, to really show ourselves on a, on a bigger stage and, and play some good opponents. So it, it's good for us. We've been pushing for this all year. It was a team goal of ours um, last year. We we knew that. We, we wanted to be back here and we felt that we missed out on a, on a great opportunity last year. So uh, it's, it's great to be here, but we're definitely not satisfied with, with just being here. We want to uh, want to be here till Sunday and we want to really uh, push the envelope and, and try to bring back a championship. So they're, they're a great opponent, um, obviously very high octane, uh, keep the ball well. They have some very talented players. So uh, we know what we're going up against. Uh, we feel like we didn't play very well. The first time uh, we played them, and we we definitely think we can show better, and um, and we're just excited for the for the matchup. It's a uh, it's going to be a good game. It's funny as an adult and as a veteran coach, I guess uh, the first thirty seconds when I walked in caught my eye. Uh, very happy for the guys to experience it, but once we got going with practice, about a minute and a half in, I realized we're just here working, we're playing, and uh, there's two goals and 120 yards, and, and there's a lot to be said for. Uh, you know, uh, everything being the same, even though things are a little different. Uh, I do think when the bus pulled up and the guys got an idea of what this was like, it does tell us that we've we've earned something, but we certainly want to make sure we come here and show well, and we're not happy to just be here. And uh, But I do think it is a uh, testament to the guys and a culmination of a good year, and I do want to thank the Big East because I think uh, it is a big undertaking on their part to put it on here, but I do think the student-athletes appreciate it, and I think it is a good statement and a good brand association for uh, men's soccer in our conference. I think it's a winnable game. I think it's a good opponent. Having said that, uh, you know, I'm not going to sleep much tonight. Uh, they're deep. They have weapons. I think the tempo they try to play at, uh, everybody talks about their offensive pieces and their possession and their skill level. I think it's more their uh, transition to defense and the suffocating pressure they put on you uh, that allow that to happen. They don't allow a lot of goals, but I do think um, you know our lack of performance the last time there and the fact that they're the last team to have stood in our way uh, probably gives us a little bit of a mental carrot. And I do think uh, them having played Tuesday hopefully uh, helps us as well. And I think uh, they've been here before. We haven't, but I think uh, you know when the whistle blows on Friday night, that really won't matter once we get going.